All right, I will be showing you how to go ahead and install an XVM package into your World of Tanks folder. First thing you want to do is go ahead and close the game. Uh, if you install an XVM or any kind of a package into uh, the root folder, while the game's open, it won't recognize it until you go ahead and close the game and restart. So you might as well do that from the beginning, otherwise you won't think it's going to install, you'll get frustrated, people will be calling me names more than they usually do, but still. Okay, so first thing you want to do is create a backup folder. This will hold the original ResMods file that uh, came with uh, World of Tanks. So let's go ahead and name that backup. There we go. And then what you want to do is navigate to the drive that you have World of Tanks saved on, it should be C. You want to look for a folder named Games. Click on that. Inside is World of Tanks. And then inside World of Tanks, you'll see these selections. And the one we're looking for is the one that says res underscore mods. Uh, this is the folder that you'll be replacing with whatever it is that you downloaded. So first thing, go ahead and copy that and go ahead and paste it into your backup folder. That way there if something goes wrong, it's never had an I've never had an issue, but if something goes wrong and you need to go ahead and, and put it back to stock, you can do that without having to download the entire game all over. All right, so let's go ahead and close backup. Now we have that saved over here. Then you go to your XVM that you downloaded. This one here I named XVM, but there's uh, all different brands out there, different names, so on and so forth. And they will probably come in a zip file, so go ahead and extract that. And I'm going to extract it to the desktop. Just right click, extract all. This field comes up. Tell it where you want it to go and click extract. I've already done that so we don't have to wait for that to go and do it already and it's now over here. So when you get one, when you get an XVM package, it's usually got a shell folder that it's in. You want to open that up and inside you should find another folder that says ResMods, just like the one you backed up. You take that, drag it into your World of Tanks file, and then you'll get a confirm folder replace option. You want to click yes and then you'll come up with these uh, that you already have files in that location. Some files uh, you might have already uh, because they're shared or you may not even have any depending on how new your resume folders is. What I do is I do this for the next conflicts and click move and replace. You don't want to keep both files and you don't want to do the don't move. Um, you want to make sure that it goes into there and it replaces what's there. So move and replace. You get may get another warning. Again, do this for all current items found. Click yes. And there we go. And that's it. Go ahead and start up your game and the XVM package will be installed. All right, now if you have a package that comes with a sound pack um, that's slightly different, I have already the World of Tanks folder open, and I have the folder that has the uh, audio in it, the audio package. So what you want to do here is you put the res mods in just like you normally would, and then also you want to go to one that says res, just R-E-S. Inside you'll see audio, and then just drag your audio over onto this, this field over here. Like so. And it'll give you the same questions that you had uh, when you were installing the res mods folder. Just do it the same way, click yes on everything, and there you go. And there's your new sounds. All right, you guys have a good one. Enjoy.